What's up, Trade Hackers? Welcome to today's update. Today's Monday, January 6th. Looking at the markets, little movement today. So I was looking at the S&P last night when it when the futures opened up. S&Ps were down about 10. Woke up this morning, S&Ps were down 20, and they got down to as low as about down 25 on the day. And I thought, huh, maybe we will see a little follow through and then what happened? Well, they reversed, went back up, and 30 minutes left in the session, and the S&Ps are up four. So not the follow-through we were hoping for today, but who knows? Could could happen tomorrow. One, one of the reasons I thought we would potentially get some follow-through is some of the uh, inverse correlated assets like bonds. Bonds were also up, so stocks down, bonds up. Kind of a flight to quality, but then bonds reversed as well. And and now the bonds are down on the day. And then gold, same thing. Gold was up huge and it's still up a percent on the day, but it's come down significantly off of its highs. Nat gas is still up, depending on the contract, between you know three quarters of a percent and a percent and a half. So definitely some decent movement in, in the markets today. Oil also, obviously, with the uh, airstrikes in the Middle East last week, a little on edge. Uh, so oil was also up, and it's reversed all the way back down as well. So now oil's down over a half percent on the trading session. So we'll see what happens tomorrow. So what else did we do today? Really, the only, I mean, the only opening position we made was a open up a new iron duck on booking, ticker BKNG, booking holdings. This is what Priceline goes by now. This is what it trades by. So put on an iron duck, made a couple adjustments to a couple other positions. But other than that, that is it. So that's all I got for you today. Look forward to another good trading session tomorrow. See you then.